live on Twitch, and uh, we are going to be recorded on YouTube here in just a few minutes. So, thanks for dropping by. It was a long weekend, Friday, Saturday, and today is Sunday. I was uh, at, a re at a resort town in Backwater, Idaho, and uh, no real internet to speak of. And uh, I was able to crank out the dailies by using my phone as a hotspot, and it was kind of a wonky connection, and not the best, but... Here we are. It's all good. Um, I don't remember. What am I doing? Oh, hey, I have an idea. Oh, see. <laughs> That's here in my house. Uh -huh. <clears throat> it's fun to watch that now. And have you ever just sat and watched it for like 10 minutes straight? Just for fun? Okay. Oh, hey, what have I got in the box here? Ah, ranking something something in the battle arena. I got some stuff. That's always good. Okay. Whoa, girl, you're loud today. Let's quiet you down, girl. Okay. Um, what do we got in the guild house? Eh, just some EXP and skips. Okay. I needed to go to a store. I think, yeah, I got all the bonuses out already. I don't have very much mana. Because I spent it all earlier. Yukari, guess what that means? 150. Yukari has 150. Do you know what that means? We'll go check it out. In the meantime, what else have I got going here? Uh, Mitsuki, Kuka, Akari, and Carl. Yeah. Sure. I'll get some Carl. That'll be Kiaru. That'll be the next one I focus on in this pile, I think. Although Kuka's kind of fun. Uh, if you can get some stars. Okay, a regular arena. What do we got? Ch -ch 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 -ch. Hiori. Hiori really need Hiori and Tamaki. So let's get Tamaki. Somebody on YouTube, and I will trust them, told me that both of those, Tamaki and Hiori, were really good on oh, Kari's. Oh, 117. So she's almost ready for a raid up too. I don't have enough for Anna. That's the other one I'm buying in here. But I might have in a few minutes here. So let's go into the Princess Arena. You know what I'm going to do first, though? You know who this is, right? Yukari. She's ready to ascend. <laughs> Insufficient now. <laughs> How much do I freaking need? <clears throat> uh, so I just need five thousand more mana. So let's get some. Let's get some mana. Do you remember how to get mana? <clears throat> Going down to a hundred, which means I have to sell forty-two. Whoops, a little bit active there. Okay, going back to Yukari. Yukari! Ascension! Okay, now I see I got the little red diamond. Guess who just turned five stars? Ah, oh, that feels so good. Look at that, 11,000. 397, dude. Where does she fit in this now? Oh, she's way up there. She is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Number 11. Dude, that rocks. Okay, I'll worry about the others later. There's a couple are also really close. And, let's see. Let's, no, oh, what the heck. What are you at? Ascension, Hakuto has quite a bit to go. Kaori only has three to go. Should I do it? That's for a four star. You know how to do that, right? We go into Divine Amulet and we look for Kaori. This is sorted by date, which means the first time. Here we are. When they're only one point, that's the thing with the, the Divine Amulet store. They increase in 
value in blocks of 20. So the first 20 are one each, and second 20 is two each, and blah, blah. So let's go to Kari. Ascension. Ascend. How much mana is this? Oh, I need 40,000 mana. Darn it, that freaking mana. I need to... I haven't done anything really in the dungeon today. I know, I know. I'm really eager for a double drops. It, it just feels like the drops aren't like coming like they should. She's four star. All right. And she has no other optimized skills because I don't have enough mana for the other things that she needs. Oh, let's go into the character. I'm curious how she relates to the rest of the characters now. Oh, she's moved up some. I mean, she was right here. And now she's up here. That's the value in her becoming four star. And we've got a few others down here. Chica, I can hardly wait to have her four star. That'll be really nice. Um, oh, I have a chat. That's kind of cool. I, I don't normally get to see chats because everything's over where I can't see it. So thanks. Thanks for dropping by uh, to work the SSB. Okay. Um, go to the quests and the princess arena and I get my thingy so now I can get uh, some more um, shards wow look at that look at that look at that I'm going to pick this one who needs to be moved around I think that's in party 3 that I'm going to go with you to you Okay, that'll be interesting. Curious. <clears throat> um, oh, hey, I was going to talk about some anime. You know, it's funny. At my new job, we were talking about things. They were like all talking about Loki and a bunch of other stuff on Disney Plus and Star Wars and Black Widow and stuff. And I'm just going to do, 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 do. And they're like, Hey, Charles, do you watch TV? And I said, no, nah, not really. I don't really watch very much TV. Uh, uh, probably the only time I ever watch it is when I'm on the treadmill. And they're like, oh, that's kind of cool. What do you watch on the treadmill? And I said, anime. And very first thing. So what's your favorite anime? And I'm like, I am going to go so far off the edge that, I mean, I just say this. I'm going to say, the Rebellion movie. And they're like, I watched a lot of Dragon Ball Z when I was a kid. <laughs> I was like, yeah, that's where that's where I thought this was gonna go. And then they're saying, oh, and one one Bone Punch Man, but the second season really sucked. And I was like, yeah, I'd heard that. I I watched a few of the first season, but I didn't watch anything after that because it was just kind of boring. I've heard that the manga is really good, but it was really boring to me. Um. I don't know. Anyone here love One Punch Man and want to tell me different? Tell me that it's really great, or do you want? To, are you going to tell me that the manga was like insanely awesome and that the anime didn't do it justice? Tell me which one. Which one you're at? You're like, um, One Punch Man manga or One Punch Man anime? Uh, and today we just got home from our camping trip, and I just had to quick get on here. And I'd I'd already done my dailies earlier in the day. Like the minute we got home, I was waiting to, we have a camping trailer and I had to clean out the tanks. And while they were cleaning out, I had some time to kill, so I quick cranked out some of my dailies. And, uh, ooh, 28 seconds. Can I kill this group in 28 seconds? I hate to use the word kill, but you know what I mean. Can I defeat this group? Because with her, Yukari and, uh, Tamaki and, Miyako, it's like, oh, this is a tough group. 
with nine seconds to go. I'm gonna time out. At least they didn't kick my butt. They just timed me out. So uh, I was cruising through some old stuff, trying to clean up some things, and I ran into Shinsekai Yori, and um, kind of a weird ending. Anyone watch it and like the ending? You know, I've watched it. I've watched the whole thing twice, the whole show, and it has some rewatch value. I might go for a third time, but I just quickly zipped into the last episode, zipped to the last five minutes because that last five minutes just kind of leaves you hanging. Not quite, you know, I don't want to give you any spoilers if you haven't watched it, but it kind of leaves you with this thing of where, how did it end? I guess that, I had to beat it. I mean, she died, I think. And was like that her family welcoming her into her death? Or did I miss something and that really meant something else? And that little thing about how it took you long enough, is that because she followed grandma's rules about the uh, the telomere thing and was like, you know, 600 years old by the time she got there? Was that the deal? I don't know. It's fun to think about. <coughs> what do you think? Anyone have philosophy? I mean, like the Rebellion movie? I have so many philosophies about that one I've read and that I've come up with on my own. When I was telling the story about work, <laughs> and I was talking about the story, you know, what's your favorite anime? And one of my kids pops off with, if you said citrus, I'll kill you. <laughs> <clears throat> so yes, I'm behind on the current season because I haven't had a chance to, I mean, it's been such a hectic week. I've got way behind way behind i'm hoping to get some time in on the treadmill this week though i'm hoping to have my schedule rearranged to where i can get back to my you know hour and a half that would be like the best how long are we at here i just wanted to do a few um a few of the um arena battles with with you here and chatter about anime for a few minutes you know catch up slowly because i'm i'm just curious how we're all doing Hey, Pudding! Ooh, 20 seconds to go, but there's only two left. Can there, Miyako? Outlast. Okay, good. Now it's just... Ooh, four seconds. Can we kill her in three seconds? Oh, come on, come on. Oh, no. Darn it. So close. So close. Ah, well, I'm going to go quick into the store, and, uh, is that here? I don't have enough for Anna tomorrow morning. So normally, I, if I can, if I'm getting up at 4 in the morning or whatever to do my workout, that gives me a few hours before the 7 o'clock rollover. Speaking of which, the clan battles are going to be kind of interesting now, because with my new job, and my old job, I could get on the internet and bring my breaks and kind of catch up on things over the day which I'll tell you more later, but the clan battles are really better if you can play in like three or six waves over the course of the day. Um, because farming the CP, the, the clan points, the points you need to do the clan battles, it takes a lot of plays and a lot of stamina. So if you need to do it by a certain time, it's difficult to do without buying stamina, especially if you're at a lower level. Um, what's my, my max cap here? 160 something 163 because i'm at level 106 so i mean it's it's kind of easy to store up that much stamina over the course of the day and i have in the guild house i have the um i think i have three three of the implements that crank out stamina over the course of time so it's easier but still it's difficult um to undo uh to have enough stamina natively because your own the farming up to 163 just over time that's where it stops so if i don't use that 163 this just stops and it's the same with the guild house if i don't use that by a certain period in time it just stops 
So I have to go into the guild house maybe two, three times a day to harvest it. And then I have to play my stamina that's in my, um, my stamina bar in order to, uh, to get it used. So planning for the clan battles is a little bit more difficult and takes more time and thinking to do well. Uh, and if somebody has some tips, hints, you know, secrets, please share it on my YouTube channel. I think I made the little banner that got stuck there go away a minute ago. And that's cool. Um, uh, again, thanks a lot. And my, uh, and my Twitch, my YouTube, I appreciate it. All of you coming by and hanging out with me. Um, I had some chat here on, on, twi on Twitch, which is cool to have somebody say hi. Um, a lot of people on Facebook. I'm not Facebook. I'm like nothing on Facebook, I tell you. But on YouTube. So again, um, uh, I just want you to subscribe. Watch the playlist. Or did I change that? Is it now watch the playlist and subscribe? Whichever way it is, it should be easy to figure out on my YouTube. So thanks a lot, and I'm glad I'm back from my camping. I'm glad I'm back here with you. And tomorrow night, I should be able to talk about the current season anime a little bit more, because I'm hoping to catch up tomorrow morning. So, no spoilers from you to me. Thanks.